Hey, thank you, PS Musical Rock, for the bit donations. Bam, is it going to be coming to this first game? Guts versus Guts. Guts versus, I think it's going to allow you Baka because I don't feel like pronouncing uh, four syllables. I mean, three. I can't count. Fair enough, but uh, Shy Baka definitely wants to zone out Guts right here because Guts is using a character that is very good at just racking up damage the moment they get it. Got in once and immediately dipped, dealt 42%. That's all Sky uh, Shybaka can really do is just wall him out because Ike, when he's in, oh boy, he's in. He has one of the better advantage states in the game because just that nair, everything combos into each other. That's up me up in the stage. Fucking PS2, folks. One of the other things. Oh, he's dead. One of the other things that Ike has now, especially because of the Min Min update, Ike's kit was decentralized from just being just being about Nair to being more well-rounded, which is definitely an overall buff. Yeah, I mean, it makes him less annoying. It's a, it's a buff for us, and it actually, you know, makes his kit decent, so it's not a, instead of just avoiding one option, it's avoiding multiple. Yeah. But then that means he has more options to choose from. And he's using predictable. all of them. And he's using all oh. of them right now. Oh, up through the stage once again. Welcome to PS2, where Zelda's up tilt, up tilt, up air can do that. Apparently, chat saying this matchup is hell for Zelda, at least online. And as we're seeing, full stock up now. Able to yeah. get that left strap. Guts is showing exactly why Ike is so strong right here. Now we see, apparently, the, apparently, her upper goes through every single legal stage, which is an interesting tidbit. I'll tell you one thing it definitely goes through Lila, that's for sure. Yeah, and it also goes through people's souls. Not not as much as her neutral B, because online that neutral B, when you see it come out, you just you, you lose a bit of your soul every single time. Yeah. But what we're seeing right now is that Shybaka is actually starting to make a bit of a comeback here, only taking 29% here with while Ike is Oh lightning kick! Well that's his Oh there's a thing! And I forgot what it was called, there is the uh Phantom Knight only at 29, they would bring it back to the same stock situation! And only an 11% difference. Very good job from Shybaka. This is showing exactly why they're all the way into winner's round three. You can't make it here without winning quite a few times. You need to know what you're doing, because, yeah. Sometimes you just get unlucky and get seated against a high seated player, but both of these players look like they know what they're doing. Oh, there's the upbeat to the oh. I would have I would have seen Baka dying from that one. No up being straight into that, but no the hitbox. Doesn't I got super armor at that up being? Uh it only super armor at the start. Oh yeah, so that means thing is you read the Apex, so it still probably had a little bit of super armor left. That up beat was probably about frame perfect. Very yeah. huge props to Baka for that. I'm pretty sure that was accidental, but still. Super lucky on her end. Or his. I, I don't know. Yeah, oh yeah, I forgot I could just use the word there. Yeah. The old English have been using there. Why not? Up throw, hang on, trying to get that up here. Confirm everything. Air dodge right back down to the ground. That forward air would have been deadly, but 140, as we know, all know, Zelda is a lightweight, so it's going to be tricky for for, uh, for them to stay on to stay alive for much longer. And there's a the forward air. Going to take that. Very solid gameplay from both. As Shao was saying, and this matchup is held, but it looks close enough to a matchup might not matter. Yeah, Shybaka was showing it. Shybaka was showing a very good uh, adaptation there. When they were a full stock down, and that, and at the very end it was pretty close. They were definitely on a roll. Oh, hang on. Uh, Warzone redeemed stretch. So uh, get up from your chair, take some stretches, move those legs, baby. Ugh. Take a deep breath, or it will be relaxed. Ah. Oh my, oh my god, that is sore. Oh god! I'm gonna do bridges. Thank you for telling me to stretch. I feel, oh my god, I didn't realize I was this sore. I'm gonna do bridges right now. Ah, Apparently that last kill was Nair. My bad on that, but they're going to the next game. Stretching is over. This is going straight back and I, I, I'll expect PS2 again. Is it? Because they took quite a bit of time there. Yeah, it's Oh Callum. no! See Carlos. Remember, Carlos always gets good matches. <laughs> yeah, and this is definitely a very good stage for Shybaka here because it's a very big stage. It gives a lot of room to get away, which you definitely want against Ike. 
because the moment Ike gets in, you're just getting blown up. Indeed so. Got my year, but I got my year beat remixes going, so I am feeling real nice right now. But yeah, already 71%. Looks like Guts is definitely taking the advantage early game, but it's only 30 seconds in. It hardly even matters once this, once the game really starts starting. Yeah, and these two are just going at each other. It's pretty much just whoever can get a good hit right now because of those back and forward airs from Zelda. They just do so much damage. Oh, up into the ground! Interesting option! Oh. Get the what a kill! The snipes! You, if anyone knows where Skybaka's from, that is the insert country here. Sniper! What a mate. But able to get the dash that battle reset at, what, 553 now? Both at 0%. We'll see how this turns out. This is definitely going to be much quicker than in the previous set. Where they oh, were having nice little Phantom Knight there trying to get the tech read. Misses the up air though. Because these two are not wasting their time. They are immediately seeking out blood. Here we are. Down to forward air getting them off stage. Misses the. Uh, that's oh. where the best can be up. Not gonna take it. Not gonna be able to send them off stage yet. Very good DI there of just DIing towards the stage. Because if you DI out from the stage, you are getting you killed by that. You just died. But able to get the uh, fire again. No, able to get the shield out barely in time. What a wait from Baka. Mm. Ooh, that was a missed F smash opportunity. Guts landed right in front of him, but with opted for Phantom Knight instead, which wasn't quite fast enough. Unfortunate on his end, but right now Guts is counting his lucky stars. And right now, Shy Baka needs to get a kill right here before Guts yeah. can get good reversal here. Tries to get the, to get the uh, two frame, but no, maybe get that up here. Gotta keep in mind, Zelda's arrows are hella strong. That up air freaking kills that goes through most stages. And once you get lightning kick, that thing kills like 50 at ledge. It's ridiculous. And that downer does have a nice spike because Zelda's aerials are <laughs> some of the finest in the game, actually. Yeah. And let's see how much extra credit Shybok can get. Only 80%. 80%. It may be enough, though, because right now this game is. I'm not telling you, saying this is a super even game. This matchup ain't that bad, but already 35. Hang on. Guts is getting in already 59%. Skybaka really needs to make some stuff happen if he wants to bring this break, if he wants to bring this to game three. Or thing. Yeah. Guts was showing exactly what we were talking about about Ike Ooh. several times at the start of these games where the moment Ike gets in, they could just blow you up. Was, oh, te nice duo tech beat. Everybody get the up tilt in there. Is that even get no hit on the Phantom that upbeat? No oh. goes oh, killed! Skybuck on Jurism sure that caught the door and locking that up there! The ledge. If the gets gonna kill, kill screen happened on the wrong move there. If if Shy Baka went, whenever he landed that first up, if he went up, that would have killed. Would have been going to game three, but sometimes you just make those small mistakes that cost you so hard. Even though that was a 2-0, the act, the set count doesn't tell the whole story because it really that doesn't. Was, that was really close, both of those games. Yeah, you may say, oh yeah, 2 well, but then you gotta check the set length and you gotta check the VOD because that was anyone's game up right until the end. Props to both players. They both deserve to be here today. And I wish both of them the best of luck in their upcoming brackets. But anyway, that is actually hour one of, uh... <laughs> but completely forgot what this event was called. Straight out of the Smash Bros. Hardcover done. And what a first hour we had. Once again, thank you, G, for bringing us these amazing sets and hosting these brackets. Because, I mean, like I said, Angie's back if they're second to none. And once it's again, Bandong. if you want to, uh, yeah. Bandong going you... for the posture check right now. Ah, posture check. All right. Uh, back is arched. Neck is good. That's going to stay there for about 30 seconds before I completely forget. But, like, uh, yeah. If you want to see more of these great brackets happen and to make them better, to, to, to boost up those prize pools, to boost up that quality, to boost up stream quality, everything, even the stream quality 